We are in the Porsche exclusive lounge today. Boris Oppenbrink, the director of all special vehicle projects, and his team make the special even more special. In 2012, we surprised the Porsche clubs with the 911 Club Coupe. The occasion was the 60th anniversary of Porsche clubs. Just 13 vehicles were built. The special feature was its reminiscence to the Porsche family color combination with a Brewster green exterior coupled with the brown interior color. In 2011, we celebrated 25 years of Porsche Exclusive and presented ourselves with a small gift to mark the occasion, the new edition 911 Speedster, based on the 997 model range. It had all the insignia of a typical Speedster, a shortened windshield and a Speedster rear end with a distinct double bubble. In 2009, we again revived the idea of exclusive low-volume production. The ducktail spoiler returned for the first time, as did the typical Fuchs rims and, of course, Sport Classic Gray, a reference to our historic exterior colors. The interior was also thoroughly refined. Another genuine highlight was launched in 1992 in the shape of the 911 Turbo S. Just 86 vehicles were built as a result of the collaboration between Porsche Motorsport and Porsche Exclusive. The engineers were able to reduce this vehicle's weight by 180 kilos. Exclusivity will hopefully never end. So Boris, what's up next? Based on the Porsche philosophy that the next sports car is always the best, the next Porsche exclusive model will be released in 2017, so stay excited for it. Yes, Boris, we can hardly wait. From the flawless exclusive lounge to the testing circuit in Visa, next week we will get dirty. The Porsche Top 5 Functionality Tests.